Hi, welcome back to She's in Her Apron. I am Kimmy, and if you're new here, hi, and click that red subscribe button so you don't miss any of the fun. And welcome to Motivational Monday. Now, on Mondays, I take you around my house or I show you me cleaning or I give you tips to help motivate you. And so today, I thought, since I'm trying to put the house back together from <clears throat> the painting of the cupboards in the house, I thought I would take you along with me. So I like already started going today and I'm like, wait a minute, I haven't filmed yet. I need to take my friends along. So <clears throat> come with me today as I do laundry, put things away, just clean today. I am just focusing on cleaning today. And so I thought I'd take you around a little bit. So come along with me today and hopefully it'll motivate you to get moving on this Monday. Okay, so let me show you what I've already done today that I didn't vlog. I just, I was just so excited to put it back together. Come with me. Okay, I worked on the homework station. Um, the drawers are back except for this door. They are fixing this door here. So I already put back the uh, school pencils, pens, scissors. All of this is back in this drawer. Here is all like the construction paper and magnets. And I hung back up my... Uh, family command center here I still need to um, put up my zones cleaning and like all my stuff here and then when the other cupboard comes put my pit board stuff up over here so this is back up oh feels good feels really good so that part of my kitchen is done um, so and it's very motivating to have this back up just ugh. having a spot for your meal planning and having it written out is so motivating to me. It's just like, okay, so later today, once I'm all done, I'm going to meal plan for the week. Oh, zones, we know where the kids are. We were a little lost with this out, not hung up. We're really used to having it up now. So we were a little lost this past like week and a half without it. So, and I would always go to look to the fridge, and of course, there was nothing on it. So I am ready to start this week with our family command center back up and going in our homework station. Um, when Derek gets back, he is going to hang back up our, um, this thing, <laughs> hook system for the backpack, so awesome sauce. I am going to unload the dishwasher like I start any morning routine and switch the laundry and put another load in. Okay, so I emptied the dishwasher and now I'm going to load it up. I have a few dishes that weren't put away, so I'm going to load this puppy up. Okay, it's all filled. I'll get that going and uh, let's move on to laundry.
right, so before I can put everything back in, I gotta vacuum out and clean the drawers. So, yeah, time to clean these out so I can empty some boxes and get the house uncluttered. Okay, I got all the boxes into the kitchen, and now I'm going to put everything back in the drawers. I vacuumed them out, wiped them down, so they're ready to go. So now I just gotta. It's kind of nice though because it was an excuse to clean them up and reorganize them. So. I gotta find new contact paper though. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, I got the drawers cleaned out. Here's all the knives. This cabinet is um, all the measuring cups, knife sharpeners, strainers, and rolling pins. This is all our miscellaneous things like can openers, and, you know, all those fun kitchen gadgets all in here so here I put all the silverware away chip clips measuring spoons our metal straws and stuff so this is all done this is all our towels and pot holders and things and then this one is all of our um, I don't know what you call it, baggies and Reynolds wrap and saran wrap and all of that. Lunch bags all in here. So that is done. Um, I am going to put the kids' plates and stuff back in here. I'm so excited for them to fix that door. It needed a little more tweaking. Uh, I'm excited to get it so we can keep it closed and don't need to see it in there. Uh, and then I have a couple more boxes where... I'm going to be putting the tablecloths and things back in here, so I'm going to work on that right now. Okay, I have all the kids' stuff in here. Um, and now, I if, I don't know, if I can find a clip, I'll show it to you. Under here before, I had like two boxes of plates that we use like once a year, like our holiday wear. And then on this side, I just had piled up of tablecloths. So I decided, you know what, that wasn't working. It just looked ucky. So I just shot my house and I found these old bins that were in my bedroom collecting junk, like literally. So they're a little dirty and marked up, but it's not a big deal because they're going to be hidden in this buffet table or this buffet hutch. I don't know what you call it. So, um, so no big deal. So, um, what I'm going to put in there is all of my tablecloths. I have a ton, um, and I'm just going to organize, um, all this stuff that I have in here in here that way it stays clean if it gets opened we don't have to shove anything in there I think this will work a lot better so there's a tip for you shop around your home see what you're not using and pull from other places so I saved like what 10 bucks here 15 well no these big ones can go for close to well it depends where you get them anywhere from like 8 10 to $15 so I saved some money to shop in my home. Okay, in this bucket I have all of my, um, oh, I forget what those are called, those round plates that go under regular plates. And then I have some regular day tablecloths and some plastic ones in here. And my um, cloth napkins. This one is all tablecloths. This is two fall runners that I'll be using. Um, this is more of our holiday tablecloths. I have Christmas fall and they're all in there so this is more the decorative ones so I'm liking this a whole lot better you guys it's not like I could shut the doors they're not getting jammed from like too much stuff in it and it's all contained and so if these were to be opened I wouldn't be embarrassed so ah, I'm liking that I did that I'm glad I that idea popped in my head so oh this feels much better so yay Okay, I have all my utensils back in the canisters there. My knives back in this jar, napkins. And then, instead of the old fruit bowls that I had, those like see-through wired ones, I think I'm gonna try this basket. Just so it's kind of contained, I don't know. I know I'll have to end up washing the fabric in it more, but I think I'm gonna give that a try here on the counter and just see how it goes. I don't know, I'm kind of liking that look. So, <laughs> we'll see. We'll see, but I'm going to give that a shot. Okay, and I went through some of our old stuff, and I was going to get rid of this. Um, I was going to sell it or give it away. But now I'm thinking I might use it in my kitchen and put it 
uh, above the homework station just right here. I don't know, you guys. I want to try it out and see how it works. And, you know? I don't know. We'll see. But I might just do that. Come on, Cal. Pivot. 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 Is it on? One side is at least. Higher. Joining me today for Motivational Monday. Hope that like sparks some motivation for you. I know it's hard to get moving after a fun weekend, but thanks for joining me and you guys have a great week and we'll see ya. Bye.